Hi, my name is Mark McDermott. I'm your average college guy. I'm 21 years old. I go to school. And I do my homework. I hang out with my friends. I like funny movies. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. My favorite color is green. I like to wear flip-flops with shorts. I love Subway. And I'm obsessed with Taco Bell. Also, I play Quidditch. That's right, Quidditch, the sport from Harry Potter, with flying broomsticks and enchantments. You may think I'm crazy, but I'm a beater and a chaser for my team. I play for the Ball State Horcrux. I should probably give you a brief introduction to the beginnings of Quidditch. The sport was created by J.K. Rowling in her best-selling children's series. The series follows a boy named Harry that's the guy, in his adventures of growing up in a wizarding world. In this world, they don't play your average sport of soccer or football. They play Quidditch. The game consists of two teams, seven players on each, with four balls and six elevated rings that are used for goals. There are three chasers, two beaters, one keeper, and one seeker. The chasers pass one of the balls, known as the quaffle, amongst each other to score goals on the other team. To get a goal, you have to shoot it through the hoop. The beater's job is to hit the two bludgers towards the opponents. The keeper's job is to protect the three hoops. And the seeker's job is to get the golden snitch. Our version is pretty much the same, except for a few minor adjustments. We don't fly, of course, but we do have to ride on brooms. The snitch doesn't fly around magically, so we have a guy who's dressed all in gold. He represents the snitch. He carries a tennis ball and a sock, and the seeker's job is to get that sock from him. This scores 30 points for the team and ends the game. Despite the changes, I still find the sport to be very fun. You could think one of two things. We're a bunch of geeks who run around with brooms between our legs, or we're a bunch of badasses who aren't afraid to have fun. There aren't many of us, usually only 15 at each practice, but the team has grown in the past year. Last year we only had eight members. This year we have over 20. Talk about victory. The team is pretty cool. We get along great, and we play to win. We practice three times a week, and they can be pretty intense. But we help each other out. In our spare time, we get together and hang out. On top of that, we do fundraisers. Harry Potter themed baked goods. They're magical and delicious. The money is mostly for equipment. A lot of the budget goes to the brooms, since we break so many of them. We practice to prepare ourselves for the tournaments. In these tournaments, we play Quidditch teams from other schools. Win or lose, at the end of the day, we can say we all had a blast. Or maybe I should say, a magical experience. I freaking love it.
Hello, ladies. Look at your man. Now back to me. Now back to your man. Now back to me. Sadly, your man isn't me. But if he ate some Harry Potter baked goods, he could at least taste like me.